Who's, he dies on sound very well. You hear, you hear melee in the background. Yes, yes, yes. We Here we back. go. Of course, we have the standard rule set of eight minutes, four stocks. And we're not going to worry about friendly fire because no teams is going to be the main event. And of course, we have six stakes are going to be played. Five standard, one counter pick. Again, everything is two out of three, all went to winners, losers, and grands. One on Dream World or Ali's hand warmers. Wow, no hand warmers. I think we're going straight into the match. Looks that way. Gimmer with the shine out of shield. Really impressive. Yeah, Gimmer has some technical prowess. Uh, he's still trying to put it all together, but, you know, there's no West Balls. You guys can see him actually messing up the laser there, but he's trying to put it all together. I mean, he does more time screaming and being an icon of the community than playing, so. And you know what's funny? Even though he does do a lot of streaming, he gets to watch all these top players and probably gets the opportunity to practice with them at these numerous events that he attends. Yeah, I mean, who knows? While you're setting up, you may as well get a couple matches. Yeah. yeah. He's actually doing a pretty good job against Mango. Trying to space himself here and there. Nice up tilt. This is the tech chase. And he actually read that roll there. He ran right by Mango through the back air. He's a bit late on it though. Wow, good get up attack. Fuck Mango sleeping. <laughs> Even though Mango takes the first stop, Gimmer already tacking on 80% on Mango. This is enough to get one hit on Mango and knock him off stage. This is if Mango's going to try to pressure him off the edge with the Nair Shines. Yep, man. That's just one of those fantastic edge guard situation. Especially against Falco. Oh, oh. A bit this time, that down air. I'm expecting Mango to exhaust the second jump and get right into it, but no dice. And Mango just pushed him towards the stage. You see him not really combining too much for damage or anything. He's just trying to maintain stage position, but... Nice by Gamer with the down smash. Three stocks each. But Mango has a pretty healthy lead, but again, Space Animal Battles is going to happen. And it's crazy. Like you said, Space Animal Battles, all you need is just one shine, man. By either character. You have to suffer to a huge punish or a huge, huge advantage in stage position. No tech chases by Mango. Okay, this time he waited for the game attack, as Gimmer already caught him with it like about two or three times. So we see one of the most basic things Lost Space Animal Mains will do. Wake up on Shine, and of course Mango again pushing to the edge. So what happened there? I, I'm led to believe that Gimmer probably was trying to up B and attack towards the edge of side B. He got drilled, so that caught him off guard, as the drill is like a soft spike, almost. You can't really attack the wall when you get hit by it. Mango trying to bait like, some kind of wake up option from Gimmer. Ooh, Gimmer! Oh, wow. Very unfortunate. This game like I said, he's drilled down. Mango's drills drill will pierce the heavens. And that's our first game here on Evolution 2014. Yes, here in the West Gate, Las Vegas, Nevada. It's going to be back in Vegas. It's a dry heat. I'm lucky. We're, anyway, we're going straight to Yoshi's story. Mango once again. Trying to avoid the laser, just coming down on Gimmer from the platform. It's a very smart option to take with Fox. You know, Gimmer is getting a couple hits here and there. He's not really able to string it on to long extended moves or anything like that. So I kind of like the Yoshi's story pick from him. It gives him less, uh, less room to work with. Which is actually a boon in his case. He's not able to get too much going. This is true, as Fox character has a lot of good mobility. You don't want to take him to a stage that's too big. It'll be hard to pin him down. And again, two up throw up smashes. Oh my goodness, he's already at 75%. Nice short by Gimmer. Mix, mixing up his recovery, making it hard for Mango to get those edge guards. Gimmer on stage, and I'm not going to come back. Randall is on cloud nine. So. Yeah. <laughs> He is not a turncoat. Already shows his allegiance to Mango. But we're already seeing, you know, Mango isn't really applying too much stick pressure. He just is expecting Gimmer. He just has a read on Gimmer. Everything Gimmer's doing, he knows about it. Yeah. He's capitalizing. He's doing a good job of getting knockdowns on Gimmer and then waiting for Gimmer to tank inside and capitalizing with up throw up smashes. And oh my goodness, Gimmer, nice combo. If he were to get this right now, he could probably bring it a little closer. But that back air is probably gonna not do it too much, especially with that angle. Ah, uh, very unfortunate. And Mango is in position holding the leg, trying to convince the frames as he gets back air, trying to stock out. Not too much you can do in that situation. 
<laughs> nice. So those nares that Mango's doing, it makes it really hard for Falco to get his lasers out. That's one of the best things that Fox can do against Falco. Just get in there, shuffle a nair. Stuff, stuff that option immediately. Nice. Gets the trade on the down smash. Air down smashes and the first set here at Evolution 2014 is done. And it reminds me a lot of the last set of 2013.